The Out to Play project is an arts-based outdoor learning project set in the playgrounds of nurseries and primary schools across Glasgow. A drama artist from Ecodrama works with uh, the school or nursery for a period of five weeks and is resident in their school working uh, with the children every day. With several classes in the school, we go outside, we explore the natural world, and we do that through drama and storytelling. Until all the birds had their beaks open, they couldn't believe what they were seeing. We've been doing like games, and every week we've done a story. It's like a story about animals and the outside world. We were playing a game where we lifted up the parachute and we, we were either a sparrow, an eagle or um, a barn owl. Out to play is an opportunity for children to engage with their outdoor environment in a new way, to see it as a place of learning, of discovery, of imagination and adventure. As part of Out to Play, we were asked to not only shadow the drama artist delivering the lessons and the content, but we're also asked to plan our own lesson. But it was particularly useful to do that after observing Ben and the other artists delivering because it took away a lot of the pressure and the stress about taking learning outdoors and realising that it is something that we can all do in our own individual ways. Out to Play I was first piloted in four primary schools um, across Glasgow in 2015 and uh, the project was uh, such a success and showed to have such a high demand. The project went on to win the Best Environmental Initiative at the Glasgow City Council Awards and so from there there was a real momentum and um, we started to put together a four-year project which we're now in year two of. The four-year project is going to be working with uh, 6,000 children across the city and 700 teachers exploring the role of drama and storytelling in outdoor learning. I've been involved with Out to Play for a number of years now, having been part of the pilot scheme originally in my, my previous school. When I came to Dalmarnock Primary, um, I was tasked with leading outdoor learning and immediately Out to Play seemed to be the, the, the place to go in terms of support. Um, we were delighted to be asked to be involved again with the project and um, have used some of our PEF money to try and um, grow and encourage the project within our, within our school community. Um, I would say teacher confidence was a big issue for us in terms of um, bringing children out to play and uh, since we've had the project in and, and, and the support from them has been incredible in terms of delivering um, uh, wonderful learning opportunities outdoors for our children. A big part of Out to Play is about helping children to realise that nature is right here on our doorstep. Um, it's not something that we need to travel to um, or that we need special gear to visit. A child won't want to protect something and, unless they have a relationship with it. So if, if a child grows up in a world where they have no uh, interaction with the natural world, when they're an adult, why would they care about climate change, about deforestation? The storytelling aspect of things has given our children that sense of imagination and wonder, which is really what we want to try and capture with the whole outdoor process. The resource pack was very useful, particularly planning the lesson that I was delivering um, with Dan. Um, I think looking at the wheel, the planning wheel, and kind of going through each of the different stages, thinking about how I was going to use the space, um, really helped me to plan a lesson that I was very kind of confident in delivering. It was quite a good piece of legacy for the Out to Play project because not only was it a discrete block of lessons with the drama artists coming in, that now we have these resources that we can tailor to our own individual planning. I think a big part of the pack is that it can be interspersed in your planning across the curriculum. It's not just for outdoor classroom day. I've learned um, that you're meant to take care of nature because then you can do anything you so you're meant to respect it. Nature is 
important because like it helps us and it's important not to hurt it. I'm more aware of how to use my voice in different areas. I'm more aware of the best places to do things in our playground that will get the biggest impact on the children. And I just feel overall that I'm more confident and more willing to go out to play with the children. I would say it's been um, creative. It's been in, uh, encouraging for our staff and for our children. But most of all, it's been fun. Outdoor learning can be fun and you can be in control. You just have to make use of your space and make use of yourself. Overall, it was a really positive experience for the children in terms of building their confidence, building their global awareness and helping them to feel equipped to tackle any aspect of the curriculum through building their imagination and building their collaborative work.